Hi folks, it's John from KingstonSandblasting.com. Uh, we just got another shipment in of some uh, items that our client would like to have media blasted. So this is really common or really typical. What we'll do um, is we itemize all the parts. So this is a, a Banshee four-wheeler. So our client has taken it all apart. It's, uh, it's been painted a few times over the years and they want to basically restore it and they've got a couple of different color combinations in mind because we also own KingstonPowderCoating.com uh, but in this video we're going to share with you kind of like a before and after with sand blasting or media blasting um, there's different types of materials and products so for example uh, we have these front spindles and these front spindles these are a powder coated uh, from the factory spindle. So this paint finish is extremely difficult um, to remove and you have to remove it before you can uh, re-powder coat. And then the spindles here, this metal spindle, the thread, and um, where the bearing rides, this all has to be protected. So we have a special tape um, that we put on here to protect uh, this area before we media blast. So there's a lot of attention to detail. A lot of people will just say, I've got a few bits and I just want to get them sand blasted. Um, but you have to understand what it is you're blasting, uh, what the material is, and then the overall finish when you're done. So uh, we want to pay great attention to um, how we do this. And then same thing, we have our foot pegs. And this is a typical, um, typical rust wear out area. Um, gets a lot of use and a lot of stone chipping and so on. Um, so basically what we're going to do is this is just a, a brief uh, before video. So what we're going to do is we'll end up, uh, we're going to sandblast all of these to bare metal. We'll degrease them first and then we'll media blast them. And then we've got some uh, different items here that are kind of greasy and been painted different colors over the years. Uh, so we'll take care of all of this stuff. And then we even have things like our swing arm. And then once again, we're going to have to protect certain areas. Um, but this is typically how we get them. There's still lots of grease and stuff. So we'll remove the grease. We'll get everything prepared. We'll media blast them. Uh, they'll all be to bare metal. And then what we'll do is we'll share with you, because these are our little hubs. And you can see we've got all the bearings and everything is outside or removed from them. Um, and then we've got overspray from different colors over the years that people... Um, have tried to uh, probably just aerosol can I'm guessing and then we've got quite a few bits here So what we'll do is once we have all of these media blasted We'll show you the difference kind of like a before and after uh, the frame is in decent shape um, It's been painted a couple of times too. You can see there's some red scraping through the black We're not sure what kind of product that is. It's really greasy. So we're going to degrease and treat it first uh, then we'll sandblast. So in the next video, uh, this will all be looking quite different. It'll all be sandblasted. Um, so this is a, a four-wheeler. I believe it's a Banshee uh, frame and components. And I thank you for watching. I'm John from KingstonSandblasting.com.